Hey everybody, welcome back to Going Ballistic. Just and I are back at it again with some more zombie videos. So here's what we got for you guys today. We got another zombie head here from Zombie Go Boom. Again, these are cool hardened targets. They probably take a lot of 22 rounds, but not a lot of 308s or something. Anyways, they're really cool targets. There are links down below. You can go buy these. They're only 50 bucks plus shipping, so that's a pretty good deal. So in this video here, Justin and I had shot two of these heads with some World War II replica helmets. And we thought, well, instead of trying to shoot another thin World War II helmet again with these 54 RPZ, these are Russian rounds. They, they were spotter tracers. Snipers started using them because they're exploding rounds, so now they're called exploding sniper rounds. Anyways, we have this level 3A helmet here, an American helmet. This is General Zombie here, and we're going to shoot him with, well, we got three rounds, so we're going to use three rounds on him unless his head completely blows off like that German guy did. That was, uh, that was more than we ever expected <laughs> out of that first round when it went off. So we're going to do the same thing. We're going to hit the helmet and we'll look at it. Uh, if it doesn't go through, we're going to hit it again. I think it'll go through. What do you think, Justin? I don't know. It's a hit or miss, so to speak. All right. <laughs> there you have it from the mouth of the sniper. Anyways, we're all set up. Let's get this video rolling. All right. Here we are up in the beautiful mountains. It's a little chilly. Not too bad. So I got my plaid vest, but my going ballistic t-shirt on underneath. I'm gonna see what this 54 RPZ round does to this zombie skull. See what kind of zombie goo we can get flying around. I don't think that helmet's gonna protect him for much. But we'll see. <laughs> All right, you ready, Chris? Say bye bye, zombie. Cool, that was neat. <laughs> yes, awesome. Well, dang it. These are more potent than I thought. <laughs> I did the same thing uh, when we shot the German helmet. Now we, we filled it full of our fake zombie blood. And um, again, he looks like one of those creatures off Constantine. One of my favorite movies. So crazy. I was hoping we'd get like three shots out of this dude. Well, technically we still can. Kinda. Yeah. Okay, so let's check the helmet out here. See where Justin hit. Oh. Wait, did this skull just flop out? Oh, gross. Yeah. In pieces? <laughs> So there's the entrance, or excuse me, there's the entrance here. Just a Kevlar. These aren't meant to be. I I said a 3A ballistic helmet because that's what they labeled them as, but I think it's more for getting knocked around in, say, an up armored vehicle and shrapnel. But then there's the entrance into the helmet. So. I don't know if you can see that, Justin. All right. It didn't come out the other side. It's actually, if you guys look on the high speed, again, these are World War II rounds, so they're not always guaranteed to go off. It didn't look like it went off, but you can see in one eyeball there's a flash, so that was kind of cool, and then just launch the helmet into space. Well, we're not done yet. So we are going to put this helmet back on our Constantine creature and shoot it again. So here we go. Put my ear pro in, I'm deaf enough. All right, time to, to smoke general zombie Constantine, however you want to refer to him. 
right in the star. That was pretty gnarly still. <laughs> Popped his helmet right off. I lost my brass. Well, that dude is gone. Definitely uh, took his head off. Oh, Popped the helmet off again. Now that was a good flash on that one. That one worked. Uh, went a little, oh, gross. <laughs> yeah. yeah, just a little brain carnage in there. That was funny. So, let's check this out. There's where Justin hit, he was going for the star. That thing ripped right through. And there's the entrance into the helmet. Nothing out the backside. No holes, just, just zombie blood. That was cool, man. Oh, man. Now that deserves a thumbs up and a reminder to buy a t-shirt because if you guys buy these blue t-shirts, you get a brass and we got more brass coming too. So buy a t-shirt today. You buy these shirts here, $7 free dog tag. Do it today. Okay. So I think what we're going to do on this one, I want to shoot another one, Justin. We'll see if we can set the helmet up on its side and try to watch the, the round coming in this way, see if it explodes in the helmet. What do you think? That sounds normal. One more round, you guys want that? Let's do it. Of course. All right, this one's exclusively for our patrons on Patreon, if I said all that right. This one's just for you, and we really appreciate it. And uh, we got some really cool stuff coming for you guys here soon. So sign up if you haven't already. Ready, Chris? All right, let's see what kind of flash we can get this brain bucket. A little smoke show. Wow, that made like a really cool smoke ring. Ah, I dropped it again. Aha, found it. Well, that helmet got damaged bad. Check that out, that was awesome, man. There is the entrance. <laughs> Check that out. <laughs> Oh geez. Gave it a cool little uh, mohawk there on the back of that helmet. Wow. Yeah. yeah, that that thing would have hurt for sure. That was beautiful on the high speed, man. That flash was, that's what I was hoping for the first one. And it's kind of like Justin said, it, it could be the mixing with air that went in and went into the liquid and the liquid's not flammable that we have for the zombie blood, so. It didn't obviously set it on fire, but again, you could see the one eye, so that was cool. But I was impressed. I love those rounds. I gl I'm glad we got, we picked up like 50 of them and have shot some, but uh, we got a lot more videos coming with those for sure. So again, thank you guys. Don't forget to pick up your t-shirt, hit that subscribe button. Subscribe to our Patreon page. We can use all the help we can get. We just had another video demonetized. No reason. But anyways, we thank you guys so much for your support on this channel, and we'll be back.